Yeah, it's been all uh, been all good. Um, you know, obviously it's a disappointing way to end the season individually and as a team. And then, uh, yeah, unfortunately, obviously hamstring injury, and then you know that's took a, a couple months to heal. And you know, I've had surgery as well in you know, in shins as well, which you know was always pre-planned um, from pretty much the middle of of last season, I was always going to do it at the end of the season, but it's all worked out quite well with the hamstring and, and the shins that it's all come together and and yeah, close to, to being fully back fit and yeah, I'll be raring to go for the for the Champions League. Yeah, um, yeah, unfortunately it was uh, pretty pretty instant. You probably see in my face there's a bit of confusion because you, you like the moment obviously it's an amazing moment but you're not sure you feel like Okay, that's not quite right. Um, but yeah, I knew, yeah, pretty much straight away, and then sort of kept walking, and yeah, that was unfortunately the end. And um, turned out to be pretty, yeah, not a not a good one. But you know, it would, the good thing is obviously at the time of it is we've had all all the off season to rest and and pretty much give it loads of time, and and yeah, we're we're in a really good spot now. I had something called a compartment syndrome for since I was. 2021 20, since I started my professional career and it's been managed throughout my career. I've, I've had sets of injections at times. Um, it's helped for a couple of years, but also the effects. You know, it's always been quite difficult. So I sort of, you know, made the decision um, that if I, you know, if I ever sort of come back and, and I felt the pain that I did, that I'd always have an operation. And it's, it's a pretty, pretty straightforward. Everyone's happy with it with the outcome and feel great now. So hopefully, uh, you know, that, that's the end of that. But yeah, you know, I can still manage it. I still played a lot of, you know, last season through a lot of pain. So it's, it's not like, you know, it's, it's the worst thing in the world, but hopefully it's some, you know, just an extra 20, 20% 20 that I can give myself, uh, you know, in, in, in the coming years. Like, it's always great to pick up individual awards because, you know, you sacrifice a lot and you're putting a lot of hard work, you know, on and off the pitch and it's, it's because you want to make sure that, you know, you're doing the job for the team and, and, you know, obviously we won the cup but, you know, I want to win more trophies here so, you know, the best I can be is, is hopefully a real advantage to our team and, yeah, so hopefully I can, I can just build on, on what happened last year and, and hopefully improve and we're going to be in a good spot as well with the, with the signings we've, we've made and I'm, I'm sure we're going to keep making. But I think knowing the pre-season is, is very long here, it's, you know, unfortunately I missed the cup game which is it's always a blow because obviously we wanted to back up the cup the same way we did last year but, you know, knowing I've got that time until the Champions League, it's been able to just, you know, not rush ourselves and I think that was the main thing, you know, I've, I've, I guess to not serious injury, but things that needed to be to be sorted, and there's no need to to rush it. And now it, it's timed perfectly that I'll be back and, and hopefully flying in, in the Champions League. So I've just been keeping a pretty pretty calm head and making sure I do all my work and keep myself in good shape. And yeah, it's nice to be now back on the pitch training with the boys and, and being involved. And yeah, I'm, I'm just looking forward to just getting some minutes in the in the friendlies that we'll have and, and yeah getting back to competitive action. You know I don't know the statistics but I, we must have been you know the top top scorers at home or, or one of them especially you know from the moment Uffy come in I mean you know there's always goals in our game there's always excite exciting play and and we're always aggressive and on the front foot and the players we've added so far in, in pre-season you know, and I'm, I'm sure there's still a lot of hard work behind the scenes as well to, to bring in a, a couple more as well. So, you know, it's going to be, I think, a very exciting season. I think we're going to play, play some very good football and I'm sure as well there's going to be a lot of goals to celebrate.